uh, we had gone on a family trip to Indio, California, and that morning we were on our way to uh, go hiking at Joshua Tree National Park. So we left the resort and headed east on the 10, and um, just like any other day, and my daughter who sat in the back seat, my daughter Hannah, yelled out, oh my God, did you see that car? At that point, we were able to see a big doll, a ball of dust um, come in the opposite direction uh, that had gone over the edge into a like a creek drainage. And my brother Sergio, myself, and another gentleman that was behind us went across the the road and down to the embankment, walked down the rocks and found the vehicle on its side, driver's door down, uh, two people still in the vehicle and one person had been ejected. The other gentleman that was that had pulled over with us yelled out as this was going on, the vehicle's on fire. Nobody had a fire extinguisher, but since we were going hiking, everybody had loaded up on water and we had our water jugs and everything else. So next thing you know, we look up People are running back with bottled water. That's all we had. And somehow the gentleman put the fire out. My brother Sergio and I removed uh, Aunt Betty, it was her name, um, out of the vehicle. Uh, at the time, it appeared that she was breathing. Um, turns out uh, she didn't make the event. She was the one that um, uh, passed away from the, from the accident. We started working on Dave, who was a driver, and this gentleman was able to untangle himself and pretty much climb out of the vehicle. My daughter Madison, who had come with water, sat down with the, the lady um, that was ejected, um, Delane, and tried to comfort her. She just had this passion about, she needs to know who these people are. I believe that because of my daughter, <coughs> Doing what she did is, is what brought us all back together. I believe that this event has has made me more humble, um, makes me think more about my job, um, how sometimes the little stuff we do is so insignificant, but it actually is important to to the people that we try to help and and that expect us to do our job and we show up to help them. Man, we. We made a difference today, and and I mean, really, uh, I think Dave and, and Delane tell me when I speak to them on the phone every morning, we save their lives, and they're very grateful for it. Mm -hmm.